Hello students, hope you are doing good. Today we are uh, we are going to learn on how to create an Android application with the help of toggle button. So we'll just uh, go through the question once. So we'll just go through the question once. So the simplest application which is available in our Android lab sessions. Clear? So we will just uh, watch out the question and then let's then let us uh, work on that program so here what do you need to do you need to create a so you need to create an android application with a toggle button two toggle buttons toggle button one and toggle button two using an extra button called a state so what you should do you should have two toggle buttons and one button called a state so while while tapping this button state, what should what what does it do? You should say the status of the toggle button. Clear? So only that work is that. So we'll just uh, uh, work on that program once. Clear? So before this, what you need to do, you want you know right? So you need to create an Android application. Correct? So you need to move to this split. Okay? Change this to change this to what? You need to change this to linear layout. Linear layout. Clear. And provide the orientation. You provide the orientation as vertical. Okay. We'll just uh, welcome the screen. The help of uh, the name of this program if you require you can do if not it's not uh, mandatory so give that as a uh, uh, toggle toggle button application toggle button application okay you can provide a text size as 30 dp Okay, you can provide gravity, gravity as center. Clear? So, uh, in this toggle button, what happens here is here we can't uh, set this to center because we have set as match pattern and wrap content, so on. Clear? Now, what you should do? Now, you should have toggle buttons. So, what we can do, we can uh, go here can go to the search search for toggle button see to get a toggle button what you should do you should drag and drop it one drag and drop it again search for toggle button drag and drop it okay so two toggle buttons are done so and we require one more button click on drag drag this and drop it over here so the change around whatever the mm -hmm. changes we need to do so we need to give as a state 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 okay so anyhow uh, there is an id for the side toggle button and toggle button too so if you require you can change it or else you can keep it as it is okay so this completes the design so in order to order the uh, image for your toggle button what you can visible which is visible over here so for this what we can do we need to go here you should say dr drawable right if you give at min min if you give m or uh, so here drawable right as at mip 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 at mip launcher clear when you click on right it is going to change its state so here you can uh, provide uh, text size as 30 dp 
okay we will finish this so once you do that you can go to your state uh, main activity remove this activity and click on alt uh, alt uh, click on alt enter import the class so after this what you should do you should register your buttons toggle button toggle button t1 comma t2 and you should have a button button btn1 okay register your toggle button and button in your own create activity so t1 is equals to find view by find view by id r dot id dot toggle toggle button 2 or toggle button save t2 is equals to find view by id r dot id dot toggle button 2 and btn1 is equals to find view by id r dot id dot button okay once you finish this so once you finish this so what is your work now you need to register your button means we need to add up a listener to the button so btn1 is equals to uh, btn1 dot set on click listener of new view dot on click listener so once you do this you need to start up your complete that what you should do you should get the status that's it so string string status is equals to string status is equals to so so what you should do you should uh, have the toggle buttons okay so status is equals to uh, double coach toggle button one button one plus t one dot get text Slash and for the mode to the next line plus what's toggle button to T two dot get text. Okay. So toggle button one and toggle button two dot get text. So should have like this much status. So you need to create a status setting that toggle button one dot get text whatever the object you have created for that object to create again the same way. Clear? Next. Once you do that, you should create a toast. Toast dot make uh, get application context. So the status uh, text is you should. Uh, use the status you can now uh, dot length long so you finished your application over here so what you should do you run your application and check out whether there is any errors or not clear so we'll come back after the program go will start its emulator so once we get the output it will be something like this clear so when you click on one toggle button or uh, you click on toggle button it shows you the value clear off and on so when you click on one thing and one more thing is off you click on status you display with the toggle button toggle button one is on toggle button two is off this is what the 
program is so hope you understood about this right